What this means to me and how I use it, um, we use a program called Costex, which I'll, I'll run a video for you in a second, just to give you an idea of how it works. But within these models is lots of information. How that's played out for me is I can spend my time applying intelligence and wisdom to a project rather than spending 90% of my time calculating a quantity. The quantities are now reliable and it's more of an interrogation type uh, and verification exercise that needs to go on. Once it's set up, we can then leverage off it. So we can do it extremely fast. You just recompile models for different alternatives and different, um, um, different scenarios. So this is the software, um, and it's about to import the model into it. So this is just the blank software. What it has is our intelligence linked to it. So it's got um, templates and current prices, so the real prices attached to it. Imported the model in, and this is a view. So at the moment, we're looking at the model space. We're looking at the view of it. Later, we'll turn to what the estimate is. Here, we're looking at the precast panels, and we can get information about those precast panels. Um, and from it, we can um, call up the precise uh, properties of those precast panels. So we can look at what the perimeter of it is, what the area is, what the cubic meters are. When we're negotiating with a builder, there's a high degree of certainty. And it's the same with um, subcontractors in explaining and being able to rely on quantity. Start to bring, bring prices back to quantities rather than gut feel of what a bathroom might be worth. Um, and it's a, it, it starts to drive costs in the way that you want them to move. The next thing is you will start to see down the bottom left-hand side of the screen information being imported. So we've not measured anything. The same codes are coming in into, um, into, the, into the model in terms of the elemental codes. We're now getting the quantity of the precast panels, which is 2,186 square metres. The next phase is we bring in our template. So we bring in a template and we start linking it to costs. And what we get is a first cut of the design like that. So we get an estimate in moments. The shift is this is just a first cut. So it's now what you do with that information. This is work that we've done collaborating with Archifield. Um, so what we've done is provided codes and placed those codes within Archifield's model. When that model comes to our office, our price list knows what it is, and it's able to link everything together. The technology is one thing, but it's the intelligence and the wisdom that goes together with it. It's how it's linked together that makes it work. And while I think 3D modelling um, is, is the way of the future, and it's a must on all projects, you need to work with people that know what they're doing. Um, because it's not the technology here, it's how you use it that's important. 